this is the last property inside position property and this is called position fixed property that we are going to discuss inside this class let's just create a menu here by inserting a div div star div close and a class of menu inside the div we are going to insert ul take ul start ul close then we have li tick li start li close then we have anchor tick hypertext reference for right now just a hash sign to create a dimming link and the link title can be a home because we are going to create a very simple menu you can just duplicate this three to four times just like this this one can be something like web designing and this one can be maybe just ms office graphic designing and about us you can save and preview this on the browser so let's just use this class of menu control c go inside your css dot menu let's use some property here the width for this can be something like 100 percent and the height for this can be just 50 pixel and the line height for this can be same 50 pixel to bring the text in center vertically and the background color for this can be in gray color and you can save this come here and refresh so this is just the menu setting now you need to just remove these blurs by just selecting the menu dot menu then we have ul you can see here we have menu we have ul here you can just say list style to none save and refresh now you can see the blurs are removed after that we have ul and li so in a range menu ul li you can say just the display for this can be something like inline block you can save and refresh so the display are inline blocked and the text are in center vertically because we have used here a line height you can see line height of 50 pixel so you can use here a margin from the left something like uh, 35 pixel of margin from the left save and refresh so let's just increase this to 55 save and refresh so after that we have anchor tag dot menu we have ul li and anchor tag so here you can see the text color for this can be something like white save I refresh the text decoration none save and refresh so this is just a very simple menu now i want to just write some dimmy text inside the body uh, maybe just after this div or maybe after this command i'm just going to write here inside heading three just uh, anything i can just write here for example example and you can just duplicate this as many time you want you can just duplicate just like this you can save this go to your browser and refresh now we have just a scroll bar here you can see we can scroll these two from the bottom from the top to bottom you can see and we have some text on the left now when i'm just scrolling to bottom so you can see the menu that we have created here is also just hiring you can see it is hiring so what is the reason because the position is not fixed if you are saying just set the position for the menu fixed position you can select fixed now you can save and refresh
so now you can just scroll you can see the menu is not moving it is just fixed here and it is not hiding just the text is scrolling so you can use this position property just in different ways for different purpose so as we have used here this position fixed property this is very cool just on menu you can just make fixed uh, any menu you can make fixed any header image that can be any other element that you can just set the position fixed like this so i hope you understand and we have just covered the display properties section so from the next class i will come back with a new topic so till next class like always i'm just recommending you that please watch all the video give some time do practice because you have purchased this course just for one purpose to learn a css3 so this is the only way that you need to watch all the videos and do practice again and again have a nice time and see you